lights of garage do today. Once again, we're going to do some squats. To be honest, you know, I'm kind of really enjoying squatting at the moment, as you can tell. Um, just because I don't know, like, I just I just haven't been this strong on legs in ages, and uh, it's just a good feeling just sort of doing some decent weight again, which is nice. I'm also quite excited because I've just bought uh, a new belt. Um, it's the it's the lever it's the lever class one where you just sort of like it's four prongs and they go in and then you like yeah it's like a lever thing it's like a thicker one um, and then when you're done you just pop it and it's uh, it's gonna be really good because every time I every time I wear a belt when I'm when I'm doing like a heavy set I'm really light headed afterwards anyway but then like it's a struggle then to try and get the fucking prongs out of my the one I've got now just to like loosen it around my waist. But yeah, I'm going to be uh, comparing the two and uh, seeing which one I prefer because I've never used a Levo class one before. Um, but I've heard some good things about it and I've seen some good things about it. So yeah, we'll see how that goes. So this is my old belt and as you can see, it's quite thin. And now I've got a bit of a belly. Whenever I put it round, I'm going to sort of suck in a bit. And that is too tight. Then that is too loose. And then when I squat down, I've got a bit of fat underneath there. Whenever I squat down, it pinches. And it's, it's the worst, it's horrible. So, this week I bought a lever class belt. But I, I ordered it on uh, Monday, I think it was, yeah, Monday, and then it was meant to come Wednesday, but um, Wednesday didn't come, and then Thursday we rang up Amazon and they said it was lost in transit, so they gave me a refund, and then I ordered another one, and lo and behold, this morning both of them turned up, so I'm going to send one back and keep this one, so essentially I got a free belt, which is happy days. But, um, yeah, with these belts, you've got sort of, if you can see, you've got a like, um, you've got one screw on and find your optimum hole on this side. So then you put it round. Goes in those four holes below. And then, bang. Locked in. And another thing, when I was um, with, with my old belt, whenever I did a heavy lift, I would, um, you know, stand up, re-rack, and then it's literally a struggle then, just to just just to try and undo it when my, my head's really lightheaded as it is. Um, but with this, literally, when I'm done, I can just go bang, and it's just released. But yeah, we'll see how I get on, and uh, I'll let you know. So I just did a hundred on with this on, and I feel like it was sort of digging into my into my ribs a little bit. Um, but I feel like that's just because I was focusing too much on it. I think I wasn't focusing enough on the lift. So I'm just going to stick this on, forget that I've got it on, um, and see how I see how I get on. Because I think when I'm when I'm wearing my other belt, when I first got it. I felt like it was sort of digging into me a little bit and I was overthinking things. So yeah, I'm gonna put one three on the bar and see how I get on. Let's go. Good. Oh, fucking easy. Yeah. Oh, that was really good. I like how it's a lot thicker, and um, all of my thought, my thought process is just 
through the legs. And yeah, that felt really good. I just, just stopped worrying about my back. So the back was fine. And yeah, it's a nice solid posterior chain, thanks to this. And then 